Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to lay out our little uh, palette, our little base, as we might possibly say. And uh, all this is is a piece of uh, pine or poplar or whatever. It's a one by six is what it is, by three quarter inches. And we're going to make this real simple. We've uh, now I'm going to find the middle of my wood right here. And this is not quite six five and uh, almost five and three quarters. So that would be uh, two and a half, and two and a half is five. That would be about uh, two and three quarters, somewhere around in here, would be your center point of, of your uh, your base here. Now. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to kind of make a little, uh, just a little design here. This is a one by six, like I said, which is almost five, uh, five and three quarters. Now I'm just going to now watch it. I'm going to show you how we do it in Texas. Now I'm going to put, <laughs> I'm going to put a, because I want a little roundness to this handle. I'm going to put a little salt shaker. Now, a lot of you people, you know, in Texas, we just use whatever we have to use. I made a little circle there. And I'm going to take my ruler. And let me see. Let me come up. How far is this? this? Is about two inches, so I'm gonna come up about about two inches. This is about two inches. So I'm gonna come over about two inches. Okay, that will give me kind of a rough idea of how to make my little my little handle here. I'm gonna make my handle about that that long, which is about three and three quarters. Come over here about three and three quarters. Make my handle about that long. Now, for those of you that, uh, see, you, you have to be a brilliant woodworker to do things. Well, look at that. Uh, I use things like salt shakers and stuff like that. <laughs> All right, let's see. Okay, that proves you can anybody be a woodworker. All right, let me come over now. All right, I, I, from this, I want about two inches this way and two inches this way, and I'm, I'm making my little handle here, okay? And, uh, of course, this will, whenever we make our little handle here. All right. Now, we're going to come over about, uh, take your ruler, from the two inch mark we're going to come off almost three quarters here. Draw a little line. Well actually we're going to actually go all the way across this thing is what we're going to do. So let's come up three and three quarters and three and three quarters and we're going to draw our line from here. Actually, let's just draw it across just like that. That's going to be, we're going to use this whole thing as our um, as our uh, palette, in other words. Okay. Now, And that should be wide enough, in other words, for our little. Now, I've got my little pattern for my uh, my piano. Let me kind of see how far that's going to go there. So I'm probably going to come out almost somewhere around in here. So. 
from there I'm going to make this thing about 10 inches. I just kind of get a general idea of where my pattern is. Okay. And that will accommodate my little bear and his little uh, piano. Okay. Now, If you want to round this off or make your edges, you can do that, or you can just make it flat. It really doesn't matter how you want to do it. It doesn't really matter at all. And then we're going to saw this pattern out. Now, I also have the pattern for the piano that the little bear is going to be playing at. So. We're going to take our carbon paper. And I just saw a little picture of a piano, in other words, and I, I just drew the There's going to be our little piano. Now this area in here, I'll show you what I'm going to do. We're going to cut this out. But this area in here, it goes straight across. I'll show you what we're going to do there. It's going to go straight across like that. That's going to be cut out. There's going to be an indention in there. Okay. And this is what we're going to do. We're going to cut these two pieces out. And these are going to be our pieces for the actual plate 